Hey everyone, it's Lauren here. Thank you for stopping by my channel and checking out my latest video for the Hip Kick Club. I was challenged to participate in a recipe challenge this, this week and it had a lot on that recipe challenge, but I thought I'm going to step outside the comfort zone of a traditional layout and try to tick all these recipe items off in a pocket style layout. So those items were to have a white cardstock background so I have done that by mounting my photos all on white cardstock and using that predominantly white card up the top there. It was also have a large title and I thought this week documented tick that box off. It would also to use three pattern papers so I have used one of the exclusive pocket life cards from the pocket life kit and um, that beautiful yellow one there and I've also done some fussy cutting out of two pieces of paper that came in there, the May kits um, that are from the beautiful Pink Paisley Fifth and Monaco collection. The other challenge was to add some stitching, which you'll see me get my sewing machine out here in a minute, and also to use a tag and some stamping. So here I am, I'm ticking that tag bit off there. You'll see me do a bit of stitching and you'll see me in a little while pull out a super, well it's not super old, but it is a fairly old um, hip, hip Kit Club exclusive stamp that I had um, in my stash. The June kits that are coming out very shortly, I think by the time you're seeing this uh, video, uh, some of you will already have the June kits, um, it's full of stamps. But unfortunately, because I'm all the way over the other side of the world in Australia, I um, that little postage time, especially with the COVID making things a bit crazy, um, my stamp sets are still on the way, which is why I used one of the older ones, um, which I absolutely adore as well. So here I am just adding my stitches. The little tags that you see me playing there, that big tag and that little today, uh, well, this day one and the today one that you'll see me stitch in a second, they are from the, um, the stamp market collection titled Miss Modern. So as you can see, we've got a real mix of different designs from different companies and they all just seem to work together. Now, as you probably have noticed, this is not my usual color palette as well. Usually I'm the pinks and the blues and things along those lines, but I thought I'd step outside my comfort zone a little and um, do the majority yellow, green, and a pop of orange. And as you can see there, there is some orange in the in the photo where my husband's that's his mountain one of his mountain biking jerseys <laughs> and you can see that these photos aren't aren't really documenting a a nice time they're documenting um an an important time like it's important to document even the things that worry us and the things that make us scared or sad as equally as it's important to um, document all the wonderful memories that we have. So this here is of um, is documenting I even I'm having trouble talking about it sorry um, is documenting um, Katie's first she likes to mountain bike with her dad and they it's something that they do together at great worry to me and this is the reason why because Katie had her first you could probably say serious bike accident uh, recently in May and where she was knocked out when she fell off her bike and that was a really scary time way out in the, in the bush for my husband who was with her while she was still unconscious and trying to work out what to do. My little dolly has no memory of what happened. She just remembers waking up and, and seeing this, the, the effects of what happened. So we, that, I guess that's a little blessing in disguise. And she has no memory when she rides past it now that she's gotten back on her bike, um, that that's where it actually happened. So that's a lovely little thing too. Um, but boy, oh boy, it just... Our children worry us at times. We want them to experience these wonderful things and push themselves to see where they can go and making sure that they get opportunities in life to explore different things, to work out who they are, what they enjoy and what they, you know, who they're going to become. We try to give them these opportunities. But sometimes it's at great risk and this was a perfect example of, of that. So important to document and as you can see I've just been 
as I'm talking, I'm remembering and worrying, but I'm also delighting in all these beautiful little embellishments that I'm pulling um, out together just to build um, each, each little pocket individually and to make sure that um, it's documented in a, in a nice way, uh, not a scary way, so that when she looks back on it, she's, it doesn't worry her. Um, so I'm mindful of the journaling. Um, it's important to journal the truth, but it's also important not to re-traumatize yourself or your children <laughs> um so um I, I document i do my add my journaling off camera here because i can't write while i'm videoing as i just wanted to get it down in a time where i can here's that gorgeous little stamp set that i was talking about earlier and i'm just going to add that little feature on on one of the, that little orange um, today tag there and I'm just using some stays on ink because I love that solvent ink giving that really sharp clear impression um, and because that stamp is super tiny I didn't want it to be blurry at all and as you can see it just fits in that tiny little spot there so as you can see I've just built up each photo I've looked at them as a collective to make sure all the colors work and I'm not sticking with all what a cluster of colors in one section and not in another I've tried to make sure I've spread the colors out a little bit of green here a little bit of green there a little bit of orange there a little you know just to sort of spread it all out but ultimately I've individually worked on each thing and just sort of done like almost like a mini scrapbook page on each little square and when you do that it sort of fills your page and brings it all together and as you can see I've got that title card up there and I'll do my journaling I've got that feature card down the bottom there and I've added those embellishments on those photos and that cute little title card there with that gorgeous Amy Tangerine puffy sticker that says love um, I thought that's true um, my my husband was really worried about her and it these photos are just captured of him is trying to support her the best way he can in this tricky time while we're waiting in hospital adding some little um pen stitches i guess you can call just to tie in that pops of black and um and put it all together and there you'll see in a minute you'll flash to the end where you'll see my journaling and there's all the cards all done and it looks all lovely Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for checking out my video. If you're new to my channel, I would I would hope that you've enjoyed this video, even though it's probably not the nicest one to start with. Um, and you consider becoming a subscriber. And to my current subscribers, a big thank you for watching my videos. All right, lovely ladies. Happy scrapping. Take care. Bye.